Hi guys, I'm Katie B. And I'm Rachel A. And you're watching What the Foul Ball. And speaking of foul balls, I'm not sure if you guys saw this video of Latroy Hawkins getting hit by a 94 mile per hour line drive to a place that doesn't feel so good to get hit if you're a guy. It must have been a long bus ride back. I bet you he starts wearing a cup now. All right, on a more serious note, guys, the MLB is trying to get on the same playing field as the NBA and the NFL, and Rachel has a little bit more on this for you guys. And now the MLB is looking to add instant replay to virtually every play except the ones that go over home plate. And when I first heard about this, my initial reaction was, yes, no more Indians A's blown home run call that I'm sure all of you guys saw. It was on the news forever, all over social media. But my second thought was, Wow, this is gonna make the game a lot longer and baseball games are already really long to begin with. So I wanna know what you guys think. Is it gonna really change the MLB and get it to that NBA, NFL level, no blown calls, or is this gonna make eight hour games for us to sit at home and watch until midnight? And even though Aaron Hernandez is locked up at the moment, his face seems to be circulating on merchandise and Katie has a little bit more on it. I don't think that we should be giving Aaron Hernandez any more media than he's already been given or any more attention for that matter. Um, I think that he's now disassociated with football. They've already stopped selling his jerseys. The Patriots kind of want to move forward from that. And I feel like people are just dragging out the story by doing this. But I mean, if people find it funny and it makes them feel better about the situation, I guess more power to them. But what do you guys think? Do you think they're going a little too far by making these shirts? Or do you think that it's funny, and would you buy them? <laughs> and in more baseball news, Joe Madden, manager of the Rays, likes to bring a surprise guest into the clubhouse, and Rachel's got more on this. So I think it's kind of cool that Madden decides to bring guests into the clubhouse. He's brought in penguins, he's brought in birds, he's hung like bananas from the ceiling, and most recently he brought a 20-foot snake into the clubhouse, and there's photos with all of the team like holding the snake and spread across the room. And I think it's really cool. I think it's kind of like they're bonding before the game. It loosens them up a little bit, takes their mind off of baseball right before they're about to be totally focused on the game so I think the little guests are kind of cool weird in a sense that that's his strategy but hey it seems to be working for them because they're doing pretty well this season personally I'm down for the penguins and the little cute things but if a snake was brought into my clubhouse I would be running for the door but it's cool for them <laughs> and someone who has recently been known as a snake in Los Angeles is Jimmy Buss and he's had some not so nice words about Dwight Howard and our Laker fan over here has her say on it too I as a Laker fan, was really upset when Dwight decided to leave myself. Um, there is that whole, you know, not feeling like he was devoted to the team or things like that. But I feel like this is crossing a line. Um, Dwight did sweat in the purple and gold. I just find it um, a little rude of Jim Buss to come out and um, pretty bold of him actually to make these statements for somebody who was such a part of the franchise even if it was just for nine months. <laughs> and my advice, and I tweeted this a few days ago, I think that Jim Buss and Dwight Howard could take similar advice as they should both just quiet down a little bit and let their work do the speaking for them. And I think that we wouldn't be talking about them right now. All right guys, so that was our WTF video for this week. Make sure you guys leave your comments below. Thumbs up if you like our WTF videos. Hit that little subscribe button if you wanna see more videos like the one right here. And we'll see you next time. Bye.